Saturday at Pony Finals is traditionally the final day of competition in the Walnut Ring. And after a long week of early mornings and late afternoons, the six judges awarded Tessa Downey and Anna Set the highest over Fences score to win the jumping class and take the medium pony championship. As always, it was a super competitive medium division with 166 entries, and it came down to the wire. The 13-year-old rider from Houston, Texas was second to last to go, and the pair floated across the ground and found every jump perfectly out of stride. Tessa and Anisette earned scores of 87, 88, and 89 to take the blue ribbon for first place in the jumping phase and win champion. I guess they do everything big in Texas and you won yeah. the championship in the biggest class. How about competing against 165 other riders? Okay, well, I was really, really nervous going in and I'm going to last line and every last jump I'm like, oh, I'm like, okay, I'm good, did it. How did it feel to hear your you know, score come out and you knew? Um, well, it was always my goal to be in the top three at Pony Finals. Never thought I was going to, but when I hear, heard it, it was like a sigh of relief. And I'm like, oh, it was all worth it. Was it? Yes. Isn't it nice when a lot of the riders down the stretch do well and then it kind of comes out at the end? Absolutely. It's a great, great accomplishment for all of the kids that are riding and the ponies. It's just a nice thing to see. All the riders that you've trained over the years, how does this Pony Finals win stack up? Um, it's great. It's always nice. Last year, that same family owned the one that won in the mediums, but it wasn't with their child. So this year is really special because Tessa has worked really hard for four years to get to here. And we've had some ups and downs, and it's nice when it all plays out. Maddie Tosh, who was champion in the smalls, nearly had her second overall title of the week. She was fantastic as well over fences, scoring 86, 86.5, and 90 to finish second in the class and was crowned reserve champion. But that wasn't the only award left for the young Tosh. Maddie was also reserve grand for the regular Pony Hunters. With over 1,050 points, she was awarded another tricolor. The grand champion at this year's Pony Finals in the regular division came from the larges. Repeat Pony Finals champion Brighton this time with Kat Fuquay, ran away with this year's top honors. They earned 1,063.65 for trainer Michael Newman. And congratulations to the overall grand champion in the greens, Samantha Takoish and Galliana. This beautiful pony is owned and trained by Corinne Beavis from California. There was one last light moment in the walnut ring before they wrapped the hunter sections for 2018. John Owens was crowned Most Outstanding Parent. How is it, do you think, that you were voted Most Outstanding Parent? I have no idea. I guess because we've been here all week doing all the fun things involved with all these ponies, so I guess that's it. So you're a pony dad. Do you go to a lot of horse shows, or is this different for you? We go to a lot of horse shows, a whole lot of horse, horse shows. And what is it like for you to be a dad all summer long and, and to come to pony finals and support your daughter? I know she has two ponies here. Yes, ma'am. She has two ponies here, and I can't be happier, more proud of her. Well, congratulations, and thanks for being such a good sport. Thank you, ma'am. We appreciate it. As always, the mission of U.S. Equestrian is to bring the joy of horse sports to as many people as possible. So make sure to tell your family and friends about the free fan membership for the USEF Network. Just use the promo code PONYFINALS18.